Okay, here's the video. Here's our here's our upper lot. There's one of the fifth wheels. There's the carport. One of the SUVs, and here is the giant fifth wheel with the slides in. We've got four slides on it. That goes all the way back. And by, and this is the area where the dogs will be staying while we're building the house, when we come here anyway. This area here is barbed wired to prevent coyotes and other nasty things from getting in. And it goes all the way back about halfway down to a stream by those trees there that you see in these big beautiful oak trees. I'm gonna walk this way now. We're gonna walk to, it's about 200 feet from here to the end of the, the pad. This is where we were originally gonna build the house, but I decided to move the house build to the lower lot, which I'll show you. You'll probably see Evan and Deborah because they started walking down there. Let's see if I can, Here's the, uh, there's a big pile of fertilizer. A lot of weeds right now. Since it rained, nobody's whacked the weeds down. Okay, so this is the, where we were originally gonna build the house on this part of the lot. And all this is flat and compacted. This has already been graded. It's all flat and compacted. Now looking back, where we came from is there. And this is the area here. There's one house up there on the hill. There's another house in back of those trees you can barely see. And this is an avocado grove over here. And if we walk down a little bit further, I gotta watch out for snakes because this is about the time they come out. And they're in here a lot. Okay, here. Okay, there's there's there. There's the lower pad. There's our storage container way out there, and you can see Evan and Deborah on the lower pad way down there. That's a nice lot too. That's a beautiful lot. So I can get a different angle looking at it. Let's see. I don't want to walk over there. I have to walk through all that crap. So I'm gonna walk this way through this stuff. Kind of keeping my eye on the ground as I do this. Because right here it's shady. And this is where they like to hang out. Kind of curled up under bushes and things. Okay. So here's a better view. Okay, this is a really nice view. You got all the trees down here. I can kind of see it. Yeah, there we go. Okay, and there's the lower lot there with Evan and Deborah. And our property goes all the way up to the top, almost to the top of that hill. Let's see if I can see the marker. It's, it's about two thirds the way up that hill and then it comes across all the way over to there to this tree line. So this is all, this is all a stream bed down there. That's why we have such thick trees. See all these thick trees in here. This is extremely private, by the way. There's no, no other houses. The only houses that you can see, like I said, are the one up there. And you can, you can see the other house. There's another house up. There it is, above those trees way up there. That's the other neighbor. And that's about it. That's about all you can see. We just have to clean this up. I still like this location right here is not bad though. But that other lot's nice. It's a little more private. That's why we were thinking about changing, keeping this for the RV, RVs and so forth, and maybe renting those out in the future, and then building the private house, the Spanish house down there where that container is. And we that container has all of our furniture and belongings. It's 40 feet long. Uh, and we would move that container up to this lot after we empty that and put the stuff into the house. So that's about it. That's about it. I think I hear Evan and Deborah coming back up. Let's walk over here now, paying careful attention to the ground. OK. 
Okay, so far so good. There they are. There they are, they're walking. They're wondering where I am, probably. Yeah. And then right now, there's our home. Well, this home away from home, I guess you call it. Okay, so I'm gonna stop the video here and go back and work on my shed right there. You see, uh, up against the uh, carport, I'm putting that shed together for the solar shed.